It's Wednesday, January 21st, 2015. Good morning, I'm forecaster Mark Spencer from NeoWeather.com. Clipper snow for the day. We'll see that end this afternoon with about one to two inches of snow. A quiet end to the week. And is more snow and colder air coming for next week. Get all the details and much more starting right now. We are tracking snow, of course, across northern Ohio this morning. The good news is it's moving out a little bit quicker than we anticipated. Right now, though, we do have a line of uh, moderate to occasionally heavy snow right here. Kind of one last punch. It runs from Lorraine down towards uh, Green and Canton right now. And uh, there is some heavy snow in here. Visibility will get reduced to uh, very low levels very quickly. And the roads will get a little slick as this moves through. And this is all heading off to the north and east fairly quickly, around 30 miles an hour. Downtown Akron, you're just right now getting into it. Downtown Cleveland, give it about 20 minutes and you'll be into this as well. Again, this band of snow right here is going to... Uh, put down probably a good half inch of snow in a hurry and it's going to make travel a little difficult visibilities will be reduced as well but the good news is here's the edge of the snow it's just now entering Worcester parts of southern Lorraine County and southwestern Medina County and that's going to move through the north and east by lunchtime I think much of the snow is going to be out of here but we're going to see a little bit of wrap around snow this afternoon you'll see what I'm talking about in a future cast in just a moment First, let's take a look across the rest of the country at the moment. You can see again some snow across portions of the uh, western Great Lakes. Some of this is going to wrap around in here later today with that low pressure system moving through. It won't really provide much snow. We do have some scattered snow showers across the northern plains and snow for the mountains out in Denver and eastern Colorado. Boy, these ski resorts are probably loving that out there. Otherwise, temperatures across the south and east, generally in the 40s. We do have uh, some 30s here and there. And then uh, still cold across portions of Florida in the 50s this morning down towards Miami. You're in the upper 60s to near 70. Uh, this snow we have here is moving off to the east. If you're flying east later this afternoon, could cause a few flight delays here and there. Temperatures across northern Ohio this morning are generally on either side of 30 degrees. 28 Sandusky, 29 Cleveland. The cold spot is in Ashtabula at 22 degrees, and they're going to have a hard time probably getting out of the mid-20s. I think you might get to 26, 27, maybe 28 degrees for your high. We'll have to keep an eye on that. Otherwise, upper 20s to lower 30s for Akron, Canton, Dover, New Philadelphia, Youngstown, and Mansfield. Our almanac for today, yesterday's high, 33 degrees to low 29, not too far off the averages of 34 and 22. The record high today, 71. The record low, minus 17. That uh, occurred in both 1984 and 1985. Two tenths of an inch of snow for yesterday. Of course, we're going to add to that today. Sunrise is at 7.48 a.m. and sunset now at 5.30 p.m. On our future cast, we're going to watch the snow come through today. And like I said, generally about lunchtime here, we're going to see it diminish some. And then we're going to see some snow redevelop this afternoon across the eastern portions of the area. That's going to clear out by about 7 o'clock. And we may see some snow showers move in across portions of Dover and New Philadelphia before things uh, taper off later tonight. All right, our forecast for today features snow this morning, then just light snow this afternoon, primarily to the east before it redevelops across a good portion of the area later this afternoon. Our high right around 33 degrees, and you can see the temperatures really aren't going to go very far from where they're at right now. Akron and Canton, we're looking at much the same here with a high of 34. Snow this morning will turn into light snow this afternoon with a north wind around 4 to 8 miles per hour. Overnight tonight, snow early will taper to flurries by around 9, 10 o'clock maybe an isolated flurry by midnight otherwise mainly cloudy some places could clear out a little bit more than others a low right around 19 degrees however where clearing does start sooner you could drop into the middle teens on our seven day forecast partly cloudy for your thursday and friday nice quiet end of the week we're at uh, 26 on thursday a high of 31 on friday scattered snow showers for the weekend right now it's really not looking like much most places probably won't see much in the way of snow 
I'm not expecting any sort of accumulation, but we'll see some sun in there. A high on Saturday, 34, 30 for your high on Sunday. Snow showers, a better bet for your Monday with our next clipper system. This could bring a little bit more snow than what we're seeing today. We'll have to keep an eye on it. It is going to bring the colder air back. A high at 23 on Monday. Monday night, lows drop to around 12, 10 degrees, maybe a little bit cooler in some spots. High pressure for your Tuesday next week, still cold with a high of only 24 degrees.